Alright, hey guys, it's Shelby here, and today I'm going to do, um, scratch tutorial on how to make, um, uh, infinite terrain. Or, no, not infinite terrain, just flow terrain. So, you see that cross that will go to all the corners like this? And just fill it in like this. Just like so. So, make sure you cannot see the cross anyway, like that. Now, that's, now we're going to make a variable. I'm going to Height. <clears throat> I'll leave a set. Alright, now we're gonna first we're gonna set the height to five. Alright, there we go. Looks right now uh, we should click on height. Alright, there we go. Alright, uh set the size to three hundred. There we go. And we're gonna go to negative two to eight. And negative 168 for the y position, so x to 28. Alright, there we go. And also, we're gonna clear because we are gonna use stamps. Alright, there we go. Stop. Alright, control repeat 20. And repeat. Uh, we're gonna do the simple generation for the start to see if it actually is a bit better. Alright. Um, change y by 10 or negative. No, and then set Y to, um, alright, so first we're going to stamp, stamp, okay, so I'm going to see how this looks, so it's always going to be 24, so just change, set Y to negative 168, and, uh, change X by 24, so we're just going to see how this looks for a little bit now, okay, so we're going to make sure it has to, Alright, so that's what it looks like so far. Now we're going to make this even better, alright? Okay, now data, height, now we're going to repeat height instead. There you go, now it's going to make, okay. There you go. Now, we're going to make a block and hold generation. Alright, clean up. Now we're gonna put this stick, stick that in there. Also, um, I did learn this method from a YouTuber named Batman Gaming. I will leave a link to the description. Um, I, I actually did learn this method from Batman Gaming. So we're going to change height. There you go. It's gonna look a bit better. And there you go. So now it's gonna look a lot better. Okay, now we're going to switch this and should name it grass. Now we're going to create a grass block. I'm just going to make it terribly, so just for the sake of this tutorial. And name this one dirt. Dirt, alright. And then fill this up with brown. Alright, there we go. So we're going to switch the costume to dirt. Alright, now, uh, now switch the costume to uh, dirt, alright. Now we're going to switch the costume to grass, this one. Okay, there we go. So now it should look like this. It's not doing it. Hold on. Oh, that's why. Shoot, it's going to be swapped like that. Alright, there we go. Now it should look better. There we go. Alright, but if you want it to look better, you could uh, do half of it um, brown, I guess. So it would look a bit better. Now, I did get this method from Matian Gaming. I will leave a link in the description for his channel. I did get some of the, I, I was trying to make a 2D Minecraft, and it did show it. So, um, repeat 10, or if, we're going to do some if commands here. If, clean up, alright. If it is uh, below, if the height is above 9, or below 6, no, not below 6, below uh, 4, and it's going to set the height to 5. Height to fall. Alright, there you go. So it's the height. So now it should look like something like this. So if it goes down a little anymore. It's gonna. There you go. So now it looks like that. Wait, it's not only. Oh, why did it do that? Why did it. Oh, oh, that's why. If it's. Oh, that's why it has to be below three, it would be good. Just. 
Oh, that's why it's gonna be set to five. That's why it's. Oh wait, wait, why did I? No, all right, there we go. Right now, this is the world generation so far. Now we're gonna make a backdrop. Just fill it in with. Uh, whoop. There you go. You have a little bit better. All right, now we're just going to make a new variable to make it look a bit better. So costumes, duplicate this and fill this in with a grayish color like that. Uh, um, now we're gonna change this to grass. Uh, all right, now it should look better, like that. Now it should look like that. We're just gonna change this look to stone. Change it to stone. Change it to stone. All right, there we go. So now instead, it's just gonna change it to stone. All right, there we go. Now, now it looks a little better. Tiny bit better. There we go. Now we're just gonna lux, show, and then hide. Like that, like that. And there we go. It's gonna look like that. And we can edit it. We can fill this in with a uh, better color than this because it's just a plain color. Uh, we could just change it over to a nice little sky, I guess. So there you go. You have that now. Alright, now I'm just going to have to find out, alright, uh, now I'm just going to have to end the video here, so I'm going to have to make a variable, and then, uh, cancel, wait, what, there you go, where, where's my, where's my thing, alright, make a variable, a T, alright, there we go, now we're going to have to, that's how I end the video here, because, well, I don't really use Mana Game, I use a different recording, so I'll see you all later, bye.